Okay, there we are. Nice and loud. Okay. My name is Neela Devaney, and I'm here with this mural that I've been working on. Um, it's behind Arch Street Meeting House. It's in the parking lot on the shipping container. This has been a collaboration between the Arch Street um, Friends as well as the 8th grade class at Frankfurt Friends Middle School or Elementary Middle. Um, and yeah, the project is really just centering like intergenerational healing. So initially the idea behind the project was to like bring new life to an ancient place and to um, think about what it means to revitalize ancient ideas, but very much so like with the guidance of ancestral figure figures. So there's Quaker so who are Revolution. They? Um, can, we can, have... can you take us through the figures? Okay, who, who, yeah. who are they? <laughs> this is um, this is the Grimke sisters. So this is Angelina and Sarah Grimke. I believe Sarah, yes. This is um, Lucretia Mott here. This is Benjamin oh. Lay. So all, yes. Yes. all um, Quakers, abolitionists. Yes. yes. And then this is the only person who's from a different era. This is Bayard Rustin. So he's from right. a more contemporary era. Wonderful um, man. And then have Sarah Maps Douglas, who was an important abolitionist as well. Sarah Maps is here. Uh huh. Okay. And what about and what and what about the other contemporary, like this lady here? The contemporary figures are supposed to be sort of just like honoring and representing um, Philadelphia community. So when I had these conversations with the eighth graders, we talked a lot about murals and like what it means to uplift yes. people through murals and through public display and. Something that just came up a lot was people feeling like they wanted to see familiar faces. Right. So feeling like a lot of times people are pedestalized in ways that are unhelpful and doesn't actually serve community. Right. And just like questioning who a hero really is and what community heroes mean. And when we were talking about it, the kids ended up coming, yeah, just kept on coming back to like people who worked at the grocery store. Their educators, their their friends, their family members. So, these are people I've just invented. They're all fictional, but I think that I wanted them to feel really familiar. Like I wanted them to feel like somebody who, you know, maybe it could have been. Yes, yeah. like you know, in some way, like there's a warmth and familiarity to their energy. <laughs> um, and what about the plants? The plants are all things that came up from our conversation with. Um, the eighth grade class so we were talking about like seeds and sort of in the same way that we have like elders and children you we were thinking about having like seeds and like you know old growth and yeah we have a willow tree we have dogwood blossoms because those are indigenous to Philadelphia and then we have this is I think this was initially supposed to be a sycamore tree. And then, um, <laughs> are you filming me on TV, Linda? <laughs> and then we have, well, we have sunflowers. And then at the end, that's supposed to be referencing the Penn Treaty Elm. Right. So, yeah. I think this is lovely. Well, thank you so much. And thank you for this private tour. Yeah. So let's uh, let's hope everyone comes out and looks at this. Yeah. And, and let's hope no one backs their car into it. I really hope that doesn't happen. How as do well. you? How do you? That needs to be. That needs to be thought of. So this is this is where it is. It's right behind here, in the um, parking lot. And this is Arch Street meeting here. So if you walk towards Arch Street meeting, you can turn around and you can see it in the distance. So I'm walking towards Arch Street meeting. So I'm halfway in the parking lot. And here we have it. So there it is. And people are still, par are still painting today. So there we are. Let's get towards it. It's very hard to get all in one frame, but I think we can try. Okay, there we are. That's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just lovely talking to uh, the artists. Susanna J. Dodgson, October 23rd.
2023 in the parking lot of Arch Street Meeting House on this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous fall day. And uh, I put this in the other video, but just to, just for completeness, people are painting in the back. So here they are, just painting all sorts of interesting things in the back. Okay, thank you for watching this, and uh, come out and look at it. Okay, so.